I shouldn't have trouble holding on to this. There's one smoke on Sue, so right now, just looking for a bomb plan that would be great. Get a bit of a money bonus so they can buy even more stuff in the next round. Grenade can land right at the feet. Oh my god! Pasha! A nuclear bomb exploding Doja, Hobbit, and Mo, and that's gonna be the end of the round. The door. And we get the push from Main and Squeaky. 5 sevens coming into play. A couple frags coming in for the T side here on the offense. Looking pretty smooth, but Pimp, now he's been discovered. Oh, they line up. Now problems come in. Pimp with a triple all of a sudden. And what just happened? It's Alu against two players here for Liquid. As Pimp guards over that bomb. The longer Alu waits, the closer JDM gets to helping Pimp. He could even keep from Main and set up a crossfire. So, the door though. Alu playing the clock, 30 seconds, and there's JDM, he had to pick again. And now Pimp, he's playing an off angle, and he'll clutch the round for his side. And they are way back into things, 13 to 13. G2 now, the pistol round coming up, Hatcher, gonna walk into the whole G2 team, and he gets a quick trade. Now, next in line, and actually a bit of a shot for Body coming out the alley, missing the chance, triple kill for Body, and G2 looking great. What is this business? Pasha, fair enough, if he's got two players there and ran to back him up, but the fact that they aren't able to follow up, Body with the quad kill, now he just needs to get the ace, but he's not in position, Shox, he's gonna rob him of that glory. See, maybe it's gonna be up to the vice all the way in the back here with the AWP, gets a quick flick, and Glaive takes three kills in a row, Shox coming up, and Glaive with the quad kills, shutting down G2. How does that work? Glaive is at 10, 2, and 2. Uh, chill out and they're going to go right into Taz Glock. That's not the best way to get started. Now they're on the B-bomb side and they're pushing up while the bomb is being planted. Dosha will get a refrag on Pasha. Not bad at all. Now four on four. Snacks gets one. Keeps firing. Nine bullets left. This like dancing and it never ends. Finally, he's going to have to fall back and the Taz comes in with two big headshots. Leaves Hobbit in a one on four and Taz even more kills coming through. A quad kill at the end of it. The other CT position himself. Kelby's in the one and done position. You don't really have an opportunity to retreat once you are seen. The Vice, though, gotta love the angle, but can he find the heads? He can! There, there's another one, there goes Simple. It's 15 seconds again, the bomb needs to go down, and it's running into the crosshair, and he's delivering every single time. Four kills for the Vice, he wants the fifth, he wants the eighth. Not gonna get at those C's. He's got two more players to take down. The Glaive towards Bank. That's Crims, normally great in these sort of situations. Can he deliver now? There, Cyborg finds one. Patience pays off, but he's got problems because not only are they coming in tunnels, they're coming in window. Stays wow. behind the big box, it works. He's isolated everyone down, a third kill. Deagle, the swap from Chris J, he's gonna find that as well. That is massive from Crims. Just it's waiting for the opportunity to do so. For map control, and so the final execution comes in as well. Dennis to lead the charge with KGB with that saved AK-47. Open things up. A double kill for him and a third. What a shot. The headshot lands and four as well. KGB lights them up. And it's going to be a clean sweep as Fnatic completely shut down there. North Post the first round in the second. He's got Cold Zero and uh, Fox close as well. AZ going to charge it on his own. That's not going to work out for him. Cold Zero avoiding these flashbangs once again. Two men left now, Kishima and Carrigan. This is not working out at all for FaZe. Carrigan, 1 HP, matter of time. Damn, they got absolutely wrecked. Joe's presence and tries to deal with the spam. A couple of kills, a third one on him. Oh my god, no way. A fourth frag, he's on for the ace. Insane, three piece. What a way to play the game as well. And there it is, beautifully done, Paz. Already done yeah, he's already already looking out the window. Great flash into the site. I mean, that was huge. Kenny S going to be a problem, however. Oh, Apex finding a kill. Kenny S staying alive for another. Oh, third Kenny. frag on the round and a 4K. A 4K. A 4K. <laughs> Wonderful stuff. Majesk, good timing from the M4. That Sage Pasha inside of the site, and that means he can go to work exactly like this. Two for oh! him and through the wall. Cajun B goes down as well. What a shot from Pasha. Four in total. 
but they have a few smokes. That's, a, that's 20 seconds basically being wasted. Maybe that Versus Pro can't afford for the push for the smoke. Snacks his barrel. Down he goes. Down in the meantime. Nice one, 85. Run through everyone! What a round by him! That was a chance of Versus Pro, but Rush destroys Versus Pro. Immediately after taking out Maiko. Oh, now he USB faster out here. Oh, what? There it is. Bending bullets. Okay. Oh my K! Are you kidding? Whoa! <laughs> okay, clip it. Clip it! I just called him a USB master and then he delivered that. I mean, none of those shots made any sense. The four lined up outside of mid doors, and they were CT as well. They've got the map control. The connector smoke will come in. The mage is waiting for the meeting. Great so far. Nails the first headshot. And two! Shut it down to a 5 on 3. Smoke out. Covers Rubino at door. He'll get in the sight. But just has four! He gets back up on top of the platform. Bomb goes down. It's only Neo remaining. He'll take Rubino. And guess who he's got to duel with next? Looking for an ace in the pistol, Magisk, but he's not going to be greedy. It's just one versus two. He can't afford to be greedy. Goes to one versus one, and Neo can still pull this back. He's going to go hunting elsewhere to try and get information. He's expecting Cajun now to be on the flank based on timing. And guess what? He certainly is. Hard to Neo's left. That Molotov won't do much. He's on the ledge. It does put him down, but he hits the ace. All headshots. All on the USB for Magisk. Just have to rotate over in time. Good shot from Crimson Dude. So walks out door, takes one already. The 77, but he can back away. Dennis is still stuck at stables and they're swarming his position. Yes. But it is Dennis, he's got two. Rubino oh, only with one. Oh. Dennis finds yet another. A third for him when he's completely cut off and Dennis turns around and finds four. This one is four scores and rifles. Not as electric as players like device who opens things up. Play by device. Fall down in the shadow and get a support system in place from his teammate Glaive and Tipix over toward Whoa! John Gold. Device hits two. This is a mirror image of Snacks in New York. Hits one palace, drops down, catches two on entry with a collat. I've seen that before. And you know what happened? The team that did it went on to win the map. It's Nitro that's going to back away. position on the bomb side and they go with these grenades trying to make sure that he can't get a shot off and so far they're successful. Dennis now spotted. Oh Nico finds himself a double two for one special and now it's just two players left standing. This has collapsed. Von Dick tries to respond but Chris J's back and so is Nico in with the quad kill. Well okay snappy picking up a quick frag and now Keeve is in trouble. Taking down Legius and Info were on the parapet there, but now he with a nice flick onto the head. Sweat is over to the pistol for a second. He's looking for a third and oh! The one tap from Keeve destroys Freeze! So it's down to Marty! And that looks like Keeve is gonna shut down Marty as well, so it's another big round for the big roster! Already pushing forward to try and find them, get them both in his sights. Manages only one JDM looking in that correct direction, but. It's a one versus four, AWP push out, good shot, JDM looks for another, he's got this down to one versus two, over commitment and perhaps a little bit zealous to try and early end this, oh! and another is getting it taken down to the box, what is that from JDM, the ace clutch and we stay alive, that is incredible and a massive misplay from Envy.